Well, up to 500 millimetres is now the revised figure. I mean, that is a torrential amount of rain. And it, it's coming in patches here and there in Brisbane, but it is starting to move down from uh, the north into southeast Queensland, and it's really setting in in some parts. On the Gold Coast hinterland, we've seen up to 300 millimetres. Uh, north and south of Brisbane, we've also seen falls of nearly 200 millimetres. Uh, in the Burpengary and Caboolture area uh, near Pine Rivers at Ocean View, we've seen 197 millimetres just in the last few hours. Uh, at Num Namimba on the Gold Coast hinterland, around 284. And here in Brisbane, we can expect anything between 150 up to 250 millimetres of rain. Now, that's going to bring flash flooding. Some uh, There are major flood alerts for the river system drive right from Gladstone all the way down to the coast. So people really need to be on the lookout. And that's why that's led to that unprecedented mood of, of closing those schools. I mean, you're talking 101 state schools, 23 Catholic and independent schools, and around 128 preschools and daycare centres. And people People simply don't, shouldn't be on the road. They should be inside and be safe. Now, the worst of this system is to come. Don't be fooled by the patchy rain that you might be seeing here and there. It will get heavier. It will get harder. And the last place you want to be is on the road when roads could be cut off. We've already seen that in some parts out at Ipswich, at Goodna and at Burpengary. Emergency services are really pleading with people to stay home if you can, stay home from work and keep your kids home from school.